Hi, my name is Ed Diaz, and in today's video, we're going to show you how to import multi-track waveforms from the Roland FAO6, FAO8 Music Workstation into Apple Logic. All right, let's get started. So in the previous video, we created a four bar sequence uh, using the chord memory from the FAs. And once we created this basic uh, sequence of four bars using chord memory, we went ahead and exported it to the FAs SD card. Okay, so now let's go ahead and learn how to bring these uh, multi-track waveforms into your DAW. And like I said, in this example, we're using Apple Logic. So first off, I'm gonna take my SD card and I'm gonna put it in my computer. Now I'm gonna go ahead, I have Logic open. You see right here, I have Logic open and I'm gonna just select an empty project. Okay, great. And we're gonna use audio right here. Now I'm gonna go ahead and hit select. So now we have just a, a basic project open with, with just one track. Now let's go ahead and learn how to bring in the tracks that we exported from the FA into Logic. So now I'm gonna go ahead and go to my finder and I just use the command tab to go through my stuff. So I have my finder here and here's my FA folder. Now I'm gonna go ahead and go to the export track folder, double click on that, and you see I have a whole bunch of different uh, wave multi-tracks that I've done in the past, but here is what we did most recently in the last video. So we have, let's see, one, two, three, four, five different tracks, and here we go, I'm gonna just grab them, switch over to Logic, and I'm gonna drop them right here. So it's gonna ask me, do I wanna create new tracks or use existing tracks? Uh, place all files on one track. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and create new tracks. And now let's watch what happens. So it's importing the file. This is just take a second. Remember I told you this is a four bar, uh, four bar sequence, but it's showing that it's six bar. So if you recall in the previous video, uh, one of the things that I said you must do when you're exporting uh, multi-track waveforms is when it asks you how many seconds of silence after each waveform do you want to insert, and I think it default, defaults to three. Well, put it to zero, okay? So now I'm gonna come into Logic, and I am gonna put it at 97. Let's see there, and look at that. It automatically lines up. Now, just to test it, I am gonna Go ahead and put it on a loop and let's play the track very quickly. So pre press my space bar. As you can hear, I have a perfect loop. And at this point, if I wanted to, I could go ahead and select all the different tracks and then copy and paste and then do whatever I want to it. Maybe if I want to, I can go ahead and use my uh, audio interface, be it the FA or any other interface and bring in other external instruments. So that's how easy it is to bring in the Wave multi-tracks from the FA06, FA08 Music Workstation into Logic Pro. The big thing you need to remember when you're exporting those Wave multi-tracks is when it asks you how many seconds of silence on the end of each uh, track that you're exporting, put it at zero. And then remember the tempo that you actually created the sequence in, and you're gonna have a great time with this. All right, you guys take care.